what is up guys you gaming 65 here and welcome back to another reaction video today we're going to be reacting to the last tyrant the last the last short film in the dinosauria um animated short film series by dead sound so yeah if you enjoy these reactions leave a like and let's get into it three two one go Color scheme is nice. Ooh. That sound does such a good job of making some making things look 2D whenever they're actually 3D. He does such a good job at it. You birdie. What is that? What's this? Oh, I guess in that uh, Ornithomimus, I guess. Oh. Oh this, oh, this reminds me of oh, this shot reminds me of the, of the Sharp Teeth short film from Dead Sound years ago. This feels like, I'm gonna say this, these, these, uh, these, uh, these, these short films, like, have really reminded me of The Ride of Spring from Fantasia, but more scientifically accurate. Looks like the T-Rex isn't even doing anything. I think the T-Rex just wants water. Go away. Aww. See, look, I love how he does this. He makes it he he makes the predators like at first they, like look like the bad guy, but then it turns out like they're not here to do any bad. Like they're not the vi like the T Rex isn't the villain. He's just there like the rest of them. See, look, then they're all chill with him. As long as he's not doing shit. The tear just watches upon them. And then he goes. This really does remind me of Fantasia. The T-Rex is nice and chunky, and I love it. Aw. Oh shit, there's the meteor. Or the asteroid. Only reason why I make a reaction video to this is because I saw Jurassic World Dominion yesterday, and I thought it was really fucking good. I do like the fact that this came out, like, the day after Dominion has been released. It's really good timing. Boom. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. I can't believe I got that timing right. That was so... Oh my gosh, I can't believe I got the timing right on that. Okay, so what, what's the next part? Is it going to be too... Oh. Aw. Damn, everything's dead. Oh, shit. 
This dead ass reminded me of the Rite of Spring from Fantasia. There should at least be been like one or two dinosaurs that survived. Wait, or did those birds survive? I remember those birds at like the beginning of it. So I love how the water is now red instead of blue. Oh no, Quetzal! We never got to see him! We never got to see it alive! That's sad. Oh, there's one of more lone sauropods left surviving. So this is what I love uh, this is what I love about some dinosaur things, like with the extinction. Like, how there's at least one or a couple dinosaurs left alive after the extinction. Because that's how it could really could be. Oh, no. Oh, poor baby. The poor baby. Oh, oh. Ooh. Oh, no. No. Oh, that's so sad. That's really sad. This has to be the saddest depiction of the extinction of the dinosaurs I've ever seen. Oh no. Poor dude. This is so sad. Oh, poor guy. No, he's going to die. He just feels the n he just feels like there's no, oh, the fact that it's just a wide shot. Oh, no. Poor guy. Wait, wait, was that our last T-Rex? Gosh, why is there blood coming out of his eye? Oh, that's a cool, that was cool. Faded from that to the skeleton. And now it's in the ground. Now it's fossilized. Now it's been fossilized for millions of years. Whoa, that is awesome. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. It's like showing that there are still dinosaurs alive today and it's the birds. Oh, what a good... Man, man, dinosaur documentary should do that. They really need to do that because that was cool. Oh, there's our one Triceratops. There's a Parasaurolophus. Valley of Guanji, I love, I really want to see that one. Swans, ducks. So, look, there's dinosaurs still amongst, wait, Ceracosaurus, oh my gosh, is that the old buck? Yeah, it might be, yeah, it probably is. Oh my gosh, this is a cool, oh my god, this is a cool ending. This is, more dinosaur documentaries need to end this way. They need to. Geosynberga, yeah, my favorite pterosaur. I mean, I mean, I'm happy to see a T-Rex and uh, a T-Rex and Triceratops fight at least a small one. Oh, the music is great. I don't know who I don't know who the fuck made the music for this, but god damn, they're good. 
The Last Tyrant. A short film by David James Armsby. I think that's how you say it. I might, I'm, the Dinosaurus series, 2022. Watch that. I'll actually, I'll, I'll, I'll see if I can make a reaction to video to that when it comes out on YouTube. No problem. Okay. Oh, that was good. So yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this, well, I want to say something first. Um, Dead Sound, really fucking good. You have to subscribe to him. God damn, he's so good at this stuff. Like, he does this great, he does this per, all, pretty much perfect way of making 3D look like 2D. Sometimes I get, sometimes I get so confused, like, is it 2D or is it 3D? I'm just so confused, it's so weird, but in a good way. And I love that style of his animation. That's what makes him so special as an animator. And also... The plot and story, the music as well, and the animation, all the designs. And especially one thing that he apparently likes to do a lot is color scheme. He, like, uh, like, he likes to do color scheme, like, to fit with, like, the scenario and stuff. Like, biggest example being, like, oh, whenever everything was alive and well, the water was blue. But then when everything died and the whole world was dying, it turned blood red. I mean, that wasn't blood of the dinosaurs. It was just like signifying that they're dead. That's just all dead now. But uh, but yeah, I really don't. I'm really not good at this type of stuff. But uh, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.